Hello, welcome. Welcome back if you're a current subscriber. Welcome if you're new. So I have my every two week empties and not an empties. We're going to start with Scentsy. So I finished Cloudberry Dreams, which is a smaller washer with. This is 16 ounces. I enjoy this one. I don't need it again. I think I got it in a sale. Then I did... I put in my son's car shamrock splash a scent circle and then in my husband's van I put by the sea those are both really strong in there right now I don't know how long they'll last or whatnot but they are in there so I want to go over bars that are available I'm pretty certain wild or wild white amber and silk is I did this in my husband's bathroom I enjoy this one um, but I think it'll take me a while to get through that one Strawberry Bliss, I did three cubes in my bedroom bathroom. I love this. This is from the Easter collection. I think this is probably my favorite besides Strawberry Swirl, which is in my club. It's got like this, I don't know, there's like, I don't have the scent notes on this one. There's this little bit of green note, that, give, and then there's a little bit of like an ever- effervescent that gives it like a little bit of fizziness to it this is just so good I love this so much I need to order I need to place an order tomorrow because tomorrow the new Hogwart is it uh, warmer is available and the new bars I am a consultant I am going to order I will put my link if you're interested in ordering um, but that one looks interesting let me just say that <laughs> all right peanut Colada Cha Cha. This is Island Coconut, Zesty Pineapple, White Rum, Vanilla Bean. I don't like this. I'm going to be honest. This bar was from last March. I just, something about this isn't vendor, like, I, there's other scents that I prefer that have, like, I am um, the Pina Colada or, like, the Pineapple Rum in it. It's good. It's just, I don't know. I feel like if I mix this with something, maybe it would be better. So if you mix anything with Pina Colada Cha Cha, let me know. Because otherwise, I don't think I'm going to reorder that one. This was a surprise to me. This is the Dalmatian. It's Sweet Lily, Blossoms, Apple, and Raspberry. I did three cubes in my entryway, and this was, like, going up the stairs. It was coming into my my living room and dining room. This is a floral, but you do get the apple, which it's almost like a the blossom part of the apple. Maybe that's why I like it. But it's, and it's such a powerhouse. I got this in February. I'm actually going to order a few more. I know the Disney bars are $7, but I, I think I would like a few more of that. It's so strong. It just surprised me how much I actually went and was like, I really like that. I put this in my bedroom bathroom today at Starburst Sky, which is apple whipped vanilla, creamy coconut amber. Now this smells like the Baclat Rouge 540 to me. Um, it's very similar or gives me that kind of vibe. This was from last February. I feel like it's a little bit stronger than, I don't have a new bar, but I am going to place an order, like I said, tomorrow. So I, so tomorrow's the 18th. I will order another bar of that one. Okay, so those are all of the ones that I that are currently available. All right, I had to finish two that I really dislike. Awakening, which was from the last Bring Back My Bar. This is white, peach, pineapple, rich amber, and vanilla. I did this in the laundry room, and oh, I just, I don't enjoy that one. And then Lona Sara is honeysuckle, golden, amber, and patchouli. I can just smell a lot of that patchouli, and it wasn't bad per se, but these two weren't my favorite from the Bring Back My Bar collection. Almond Croissant I did in my entry. This is such a powerhouse, you guys. This is not my favorite. I know a lot of people said King Cake was like the poor man's Almond Croissant. I think I heard someone say that, which is kind of funny, but I don't enjoy Almond Croissant, so King Cake is much better to me. Um, so hopefully you snag some of that because I do not care for almond croissant. Let me know what you mix that one to tame it because that it's got like this cloyingly sick like brown sugar or something in it that I just don't like. Midnight Masquerade was from the uh, Mardi Gras collection. Is this again I get like this burnt sugar scent in this. Is this the one that was like beignets and floral? It's just it's just odd. 
Vanilla Waves, a favorite of mine. I'm trying to go through some of my sweaty Vanilla Waves bar, but this is sea salt, caramel, amazingness. Why did this never come back? I don't understand Scentsy at all. I finished my last bar of lavender and white balsam. Now this one was bagged and one of them wasn't bagged. They both pretty much lost their scent. This is from two years ago, Bring Back My Bar, I think, or maybe even three years now. It, I couldn't smell it. It was in my candle crock at night and I literally didn't know it was in my candle crock. And then I've been working on the candle crock at night doing uh, candy cane buttercream. I did this on two separate occasions. I threw a bar in and let it go for a night. I could not smell this. And then I tried another bar. It, you just, it's not strong enough. I, it's a good scent if it was stronger, but this is so, so light. I don't know. It's, I, that was in just the last catalog. I just couldn't get performance from it. Hazelnut frosting. These are older bars that I got. Um, this is heavenly hazelnut cream whipped with golden vanilla and hint of ginger. This is amazing. I love this hazelnut. It's more nutty than it is like anything else. It's just so good with that frosting. Oh my gosh, I love that scent. I have a few more bars of that. I threw a coffee time. This was a bring back my bar. This I don't like. I put mix this with a vendor wax just to get rid of it because I don't enjoy it. Now the last three are the ones I really love. I did um, three cubes because I had only one out of this Big Hero 6. This is ba basically the best fruit punch ever. Oh, if I could only have one Disney bar, well, I'd say two. It would be Big Hero 6 and um, the Disney just want, uh, the Evil Queen, the red bar that smells like apple s'mores. Like, if I could get this in my club, I would keep this for $7. This is the best fruit punch I've ever smelled. And that includes Bender. Like, that was so, so good. And then a lot of you probably don't remember this. This was, this is a newer um, bar. I think I got, this is in my club, okay? First of all, it's Blueberry Burst. It's juicy blueberry, black raspberry sweetened with caramelized sugar. I don't know what it is about this one, but... I love it. It doesn't smell good on cold, but then you put this in the warmer and it's just a different take on blueberry. Oh, it's just the blueberry and the sugar and then the black raspberry in here. I, this is just so good. I have a few pods left in this that I got on sale in clearance and I only have a few more bars of this, but it is in my club. But this is just, I don't like blueberry scents, but I love this scent. Let me know if you liked blueberry burst. The lemon drizzle was in that collection as well and then the ras there was a raspberry pop or something um but i don't understand how the lemon one is in the catalog i literally can all i can smell in that one is lavender i just don't like that one all right anyway and then i did a mix i've had this bar of simply rose for quite a while and i'm trying to work on some older clams this was a bring back my bar I think I got this from a friend and then I was like, okay, I need to start mixing this because it's very, very, very strong. Now they do have the new and the new blossoms, the Disney, they're not Disney labels, but they are last year. If you remember like mint fields and some of the other ones, there's a rose one in there. I think I'm going to grab because I loved this combo. So I did simply rose taste of summer which I only have one more bar of and I only I think I used three cubes two of the rose this is like a, a southern sweet tea I think um this is really good I'll have to get a few more to do this mixture and then I only put in well I did three cubes of this three cubes of this and then two of the rose and I did them in different warmers in my studio here this is flower shop and this is just like walking into a flower shop this was so good. I will just say that mixing these three, I was kind of like, I don't know, because fl Flower Shop, Rose, and then the, I liked the lemon in this. And I just thought, I'm going to try mixing it. Um, I let this go like for four days in my studio when I was up here editing photos. And I, I'm, I can't wait to warm this again. This was exceptional. I loved, loved this. So let me know. If you know what else to mix with Simply Rose, um, 
like I said, I am going to grab another bar of rose from that Blooms collection. Um, and then I did order a vendor rose to try as well. But I do need, if you guys know of a dupe of Taste of Summer, I like I said, I have one bar. You don't need a lot of this because this is super strong. But if I see this in clearance again or something, I would totally buy like four of these because this is so strong. So that's my sense. Yeah, I want to see how long the video is. And then I'm going to decide if I'm going to do a separate video of my vendor because I have a lot of vendor this was for just over two weeks and I did get through a lot of wax even working so hang on but if I end this video I just want to say I hope you guys are all doing well check out um, my uh, Scentsy link for like there's so many good new bars out there you guys if you have any questions just message me let me know if you want your own shopping link so you can earn your own host hostess rewards let me know and you can just shop at that at your leisure and when you hit 200 you can cash it out or you can continue to grow your link i have several customers and friends who do that and then that way you're earning free stuff so let me know with that being said i hope you all have a wonderful beautiful blessed day bye mm -hmm.